Welcome Dragon Champions to another Dragon Long Gaming Presents Dragon Champions video. I am your host Dragon. Thank you so much for being here today. If you are new around here, hit that subscribe button, hit that notifications bell so you don't miss a thing and drop a comment down below. We have some new news. So let's go ahead and jump over to the Discord if you have not seen this, but as of today, uh, Lizard Breath posted, hello Dragon Champions. So we're going to talk about the anticipated Battlegrounds mode um, and she has some news to share with us. And so I'm going to go ahead and read this post. I hope this video is relatively short, um, but I'm going to go ahead and read the post, give you guys what my thoughts are on this. And uh, I do also another programming note. I know I keep saying I'm going to uh, put out a Goblins video, Goblin Tower video. I am trying to get that. I've got a, the gameplay that I'm looking at. You're actually seeing some of it right now up on the screen. But I have a really cool opportunity. I'm going to be talking with Shaking Gaming. If you're not use, if you have not seen his stuff, link down in the description below. Go check him out. He has a top. He has a, a tier list. Uh, that he compiled that he put out just a couple of days ago. I find it very interesting. He's got a formula and everything. I'm going to bring him on the channel tomorrow. We're going to talk. I'm going to bring him on the channel and put that video out um, and have him explain his formula and that sort of stuff. Introduce you guys to Shaking Gaming. A uh, really cool opportunity. So without further ado, let's get into this. It says, many of you have been wondering things about the anticipated battlegrounds, so we wanted to share some news with you. We've studied the feedback and provided uh, by our beta testers, which is including me, uh, and by you closely, and we thank you all so much for that. I uh, had multiple internal play tests and came to the conclusion that the current iteration of Battlegrounds and Artifacts doesn't look the way we want it to. Uh, after some discussion, we made the decision to rework both Artifacts and Battlegrounds based on the feedback and our conclusions to make them more exciting to play. We have taken a, uh, taken a look on how transparent and comprehensible artifact system was and if it was fun and exciting to play with them after that we came to the conclusion that not only do they need to be a, a do-over but they also also that we needed to do more than we initially planned moreover every artifact is going to have a unique passive ability this will give us more opportunities to uh, customize options for our characters uh, we also uh, changed artifact upgrade process and we'll share more about that later now on to battleground tweaks we realize that some of you are anxious about the possibility of not being able to get guildmates into battlegrounds thus they have changed the way matchmaking uh, is going to work so you can form teams with players outside of your guild as well they've also decided that they're going to uh they're going to bring the new game build in, but not everybody's going to be ready for longer play sessions or don't have a big enough roster to compete in 3v3 battles. And this is why they've decided to make Battlegrounds a 1v1 mode as well. So the ranking system will be the same. So we're going to have two Battleground modes. We're going to have a 1v1 and a 3v3. However, you'll be getting more points for the 3v3 battles, which gives you uh, more incentive to play the 3v3 battles. The rewards for both modes will be the same. To participate in the Battlegrounds, you'll be required... Uh, special tickets that were restored weekly these tickets are the same for both one and uh, 3v3 battles battleground sessions will have time limits we understand that everyone has real lives and cannot spend their whole lives in the game which is really good it's all right a lot of us are really busy especially me uh, battleground sessions will have time limits right i just said that uh, we are planning to divide uh, the battlegrounds based on total power the higher your power is, the more battles you'll be taking part in. Thus, the game mode will adapt to your current power and progress. In the future, probably not in the first Battleground season, we want to implement partial progress between Battleground seasons. Uh, that way, if you are finished, um, if you finish the season in the Platinum League, then you'll start in the next season in the Golden League and not start over from scratch. That seems very interesting. Uh, we want to release quality content for for you to play. This is the reason why we're not rushing it. We're making sure that everything works well and is properly designed and tested. Sadly, due to that, we will not be able to deliver this as soon as possible. We are planning to release it in a few weeks. Hopefully you like the news and are more excited to play uh, Battlegrounds and stay tuned. We'll be sharing more news about Battlegrounds and artifacts. That sounds great. Once again, once again, the Dragon Champions developers, um, the dev team here, cares about our gameplay, cares about putting out a quality product. 
they want to put it out and make it right now i've heard a lot of we've heard a lot of complaints especially when we were talking about the sim ticket issue about we need content to the game we need content we do but you don't want rushed content and they don't want to rush it and so I'm going to take them at their word that they're working on this. I've played Battlegrounds. I've been a part of the test. It's a ton of fun, but there were bugs and it needed to be overhauled. It did. There's no doubt about that. It needed to be overhauled. It needed work and they are putting in the time and the work for it. And that is all we can ask for them to do. They're doing a fabulous job and we're getting great characters. We're getting other stuff. We are getting some content, but not a lot. That's true. Not a lot. So there is a bug there is that but when we do get battlegrounds it's going to be amazing and that's the point they want to they don't want to rush this they want to make it right and i fully support that um if you are new around here i'm gonna like i said i'm gonna keep this real video short real real short um if you are new around here hit that subscribe button hit that notifications bell so you don't miss a thing and we will see you next time wing gaming and the law intersect